on the southern border. Did you receive a briefing about the border today? Uh, yes, I did. What did you learn? A lot. Is there a crisis at the border, sir? Sure. Is the White House launching any programs to help those states transition fossil fuel workers into green tech, or are they leaving that up to the governors? Uh, I'm not familiar with the interior program. I'm happy to certainly check on that. Uh, as I've noted in here before, uh, the president is committed to uh, moving forward on the rest of his Build Back Better agenda. We're going to wait until we're through the American Rescue Plan, and that is signed into law. Direct checks are going out to the American people, more money to get vaccines into arms. Schools are starting to reopen with money. So that's our focus now. But he believes that we can uh, invest in areas like infrastructure and do that in a way that creates uh, good paying green jobs that are good paying union jobs. And so I have nothing more to preview other than that remains his commitment. And over 100 illegal immigrants in Texas have tested positive for the virus. Now free, they're heading to different parts of the country. This made possible by the newly revived catch and release policy and no requirement for negative tests. Here's the details. It's been one month since President Biden rescinded President Trump's policy that stopped catch and release. Now migrants crossing the border illegally are being released into the U.S. and they're not being tested for the virus first. Instead, communities along the border are testing migrants themselves after their release. Felipe Romero, a spokesperson for Brownsville, Texas, told Fox News that 108 migrants tested positive for the virus since January 25th. Now you know he did learn a lot. A lot of all the shit. Let's get ready to hit America again. We're down curving. But Biden wants to up curb the fucking coronavirus. That's why you are a CCP fucking whore hopping little bitch. Beijing bunker Biden. And when it spikes, guess who administration is at fault for it. Trump's not in office. He's out. You can blame Trump no more for none of your fucking stupid shit. And the first part of this video proves positive. You have no way of knowing what to do with a green deal. The only thing you've done is just cut more jobs. That's it. What are they going to do? Go to China and put them fuckers together? Are you a stupid human being? Well, looking at you right now, yeah, I'd say you are. What do you think about that, you dumb fucks that goddamn voted for this bastard? Go to China and make your fucking goddamn solar panels. At least that way you'll understand what it means to be an American. You anti-fucking American piece of garbage. And the Obama aide was correct when he said you belong nowhere near foreign policy. Nowhere do you belong in foreign policy. I am pissed, but leave a like, leave a dislike, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel. If you so do wish, because as an American... This is putting blame in my soul. Hope you liked the video. Have a nice day.